Welcome, we've made it to Tokyo, Japan. It is as cold as Paris. But it's nice to be here. It's my fourth time being here. I'm happy to be back. And we're on our way, on our way to go play football. So let's go play. We're about to head into Sydney Gym and get some food. Usually I like to have a snack or two. Football here in Japan, the easiest way to get something on the road is 7 Eleven. The food's actually good, it's not fast, the process. Dog, it's. So yeah, we're gonna get some 7 Eleven. And get going. All right, so we made it to the field. Uh, we actually just ran into a German, and as you guys know, I played football in Germany. Quality of football in Germany was really good. So uh, I'm excited to see what the quality is like here in Japan. We're about to run a warm up. I bought a ball, of course, bought boots. Whenever I travel, those are absolute essentials. And we actually have a matching breakfast. Uh, me and the brother here. As you can see, cameraman TJ has decided to uh, open mind for me and we got matching uh, breakfasts lovely coffee and onagiri and then look at this big field this is beautiful oh la 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 and then this is our field <laughs> all right what is good guys welcome back all right we got the commentary going again guys and let me just say i have to give the japanese dudes their flowers these guys absolutely annihilated me and they had me in their back pocket these dudes had my number every single minute of this game i cannot even believe how badly i was beaten in this game and just outclassed really in terms of global football that i've played i have to be honest i think japan or tokyo players in general were the best that I have played against and I'm really I'm trying to be honest here and very you know objective I'm not going to talk too much about the gameplay it does speak for itself you can see that dude literally just tripped two of us up he's annihilating us but let me just say these guys fundamentally passing casually and just destroyed and picked us apart my team ended up winning but it was no help from me I'll be honest I, I played like you can see here some nice dribbling. It's okay. This this could have been a goal very easily. We played around with it. But on the day, my finishing was not there. I did not play the best. And I was, in all honesty, the second best, second worst player on the field. I'm not trying to um, blow smoke up my ass. Look at that turn, man. I could have turned that dude so sharply if I tried, but completely failed. Uh, just observationally, uh, how quick they were, the, the crispness of the passing, the movement. The Japanese guys, man, they are very good footballers. And I learned a thing or two playing here in Tokyo. Uh, I just wanted to come on and say, again, if you guys are interested in watching more of these videos where I travel and vlog, please let me know down below in the comments, guys. I like and I will reply to every single comment that I get. Look at that header. If I had scored that header, that would have been crazy with the GoPro on. And every game I get asked, hey, how are you going to hit the ball? Guys, I hit the ball regardless. I do not care if I get a dent in my head. I can get a dent. I don't mind. I just want to score the goal, right? But yeah, so if you guys do enjoy these travel videos where I, where I um, travel and it's a bit more cinematic, just please let me know. I do a lot of, look at that touch, touch of a pedo. What the hell is that, bro? At least I apply the pressure and... We, we make a little something out of it, but they end up getting the ball anyway. Um, but yeah, if you guys do want to see these travel style videos, please, please let me know. I, I love making them, man. And when I do travel, I tend to travel um, in quite a, um, at times, luxurious fashion, you know. And um, just recently, the most recent trip, I bought a new watch. I'm, obviously, I'm, I'm a watch guy, man. I love watches, but mostly I love travel. That could have been a nice pass back into him. I did say leave, leave, leave. He picked it up. And I do believe we actually score from this. No, he saves it. So, 
yeah, I am very interested in making more travel videos for you guys if you want to see what it's like to travel, play football, and uh, more of what I do. But obviously, football is the focus here. I don't want to make this all about me unless you guys want to know more. Then, uh, yeah, there's a strike. We don't make much of it. Again, cycling the ball. Now, this dude with the ball in the French top, this guy's a baller. I think this dude, he's, he's either 30 years old or 60. But the broken ball, he was doing crazy stepovers. He scored, I think, four goals. Look at that nice long pass. I nearly get to it. I think I might have got a touch onto that. Uh, but overall, um, this guy, this dude is the best player on the field. I don't know if you can just see by the way he runs, but his touches, his playmaking, everything. And um, yeah, the shot selection these guys had was just crisp. It was, it was a pleasure to play against. I love that move that he did. I don't know if you call that like a feint, but just that quick leg flick into the feint. That I love that. So technically just skillful. Um, yeah, man, it was it was a pleasure to play in Japan. But anyway, guys, I'm going to uh, be signing off. I have a busy night tonight. I hope you enjoy the gameplay footage. I might still commentate over it. I have not fully decided. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to drop a like. Remember to subscribe, guys. I'm going to be traveling more and more. Next up, we have a, have, we have, a, have a very unique country coming up. I don't even know if I can play football there yet, to be honest. I'm going to try my absolute best to play football there. But every single month I travel to a new country and I play football in the country, film it, document it all. And you guys can see the quality of football players. And I'm not playing in some, some ass leagues, guys. I'm trying to play it against what that area, wherever I'm at, what their best level is. This, this was a, a high level game, intermediate plus. And like I said, I was the second worst player on the field. I don't even know who the worst guy was. Actually, I do. I just don't want to name and shame him. There's no need uh, because I'm just as ass, basically. A little touch, a little run, I flick on. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm trying to put on some dribbles on. I lose position. Anyway, you get tackled like a fool. The brother from Germany takes the ball off of me. And we just continue to cycle the ball. You can see that's a great pass from her, man. I, if, if, my, if my touch, the turn was better. Again, I didn't even expect the back heel. I kicked right into the player's leg. Thankfully, Yatoro, um, or Yatoro, I can't remember his name. But that dude, is he's so friendly and such a baller, man. Dude's incredible. You can just see our team in general can cycle the ball well. We play well. I leave another good opportunity on the table there. Uh, I am learning to play with some more confidence here, guys. That is, oh, that's a dirty ass turn, bro. I run it. What can I do with it? I, I think at the time I wanted to turn this guy just to see if I could. But Anton, the French dude, he was calling for it. It made more sense to pass it to the real baller in the team. And that is where I can see as a player, I still need to develop. Look at that pressure, man. I always press these dudes. I'm telling you, I'm always pressuring them. But as a player, that's something I still have to absolutely develop. And that is on the ball confidence. Look, like, I'm not afraid of taking this dude on. I'm physically stronger. But in terms of when I take the shot, do I take the shot? In this game, you will see, I decide to make, and I, I decide to take a shot and it pays off. But look at Anton. This guy scored four goals. He's already missed two or three shots. But the thing is, he takes the shots, and I don't. As a football player, you have to have the confidence to take this shot, even if it means humiliating yourself. Now, here's a good run by me. Good through ball. I didn't expect that back. And thank fuck I finished. If I did not finish that, I, I needed that confidence, man. I was so nervous. <laughs> I think we finished like 30 minutes. It's like eight aside, nine aside. I'm shattered. I assisted two goals, but they were assists. I, I meant it though, right? I meant it. I definitely meant to assist those goals. But besides that, I'm absolutely shattered, if you can't tell. I'm wearing the most casual clothing in the world, and it doesn't help when you're trying to run at 100k an hour, and these Japanese dudes, bro, their fundamentals are crazy. This dude just lobbed a pass from his half all the way to our six yard box. They're really good. Time for the GoPro. Back in from that little halftime chat there, guys. I was exhausted. I actually thought the game was over, but it wasn't. Uh, the tempo, that, that this, the, the pace we play at, the tempo is, is very fast, and I found it just tiring in general. Uh, but obviously, I love it. I love being challenged like this. But as I was saying, you have to play with confidence, and even more so when you play with these guys who know exactly what they're doing. Uh, it's just it's one mistake can cost you, and I think that is really the thing that in my mind sticks out when I play is... I can either push myself and go for something risky 
or I can play it safe. Excuse me. Or I can play it safe and pass to someone I know is, is, a, is a tad better, you know, or possibly better. But when I took the shot, guys, I actually made a crucial goal. <laughs> fine, fine. <laughs> this dude was cool, man. He's like half my height, but he actually resembles a messy Japanese messy reincarnated version of Messi. And uh, I'm, I'm about to take this man on in the line. He knows he can chop me up. Bro, what the hell? He puts me on my ass, bro. That's humiliating. I just got put on my ass and this dude barely did a step over. That's just... If you're enjoying this video at the moment, please remember to drop a like and comment down below if you want the more cinematic vlog style. I love to show the world to you guys because I do travel a lot. Back to the video. I'm, I'm trying, man. I'm trying, but you can see these dudes are just... They're running, they're running laps around me, man. They're, they're honestly running laps around me. It doesn't matter. The team's still trying to distribute the ball to me. Nice chest pass. It's a pity I couldn't control it as well. I'm really trying to maintain this high press, and I asked a, a few players, why don't they play man-to-man -man defense in football? Apparently, it's just not sustainable. Here's a good opportunity, though. Brother, I'm not going to lie. That was a lousy pass from him. I'm not going to lie. That, that was not the best pass. I get a good ball here. What can I do with it? Straight to the feet of the man. He has to score that. Doesn't put it away though. But I'll be honest, I'm proud of these key passes I make here. Because at times, I feel like... I, I did assist a few goals in these games, man. And I'm, I'm really proud of them. Because those are those moments that build up your confidence. And I think sometimes I need that... Just that tad of confidence. to Just to give me some enthusiasm to play. When I play with these players much better than me. I don't give up... Nearly get a goal there as well. It would have been a lucky, fluky goal. I go for an intercept here. Actually make him fumble the turn. And you can see, though, he knows he's a player behind him. Good observation. And he picks up the ball. Great touch. And they're off running. I actually stopped dead in my tracks here because I, I felt so defeated. I thought I would catch him and I just couldn't. You don't have so much time, bro. And I managed to f a left-footed cross. Like, I could have just cut inside and shot, but no. Nah. Easy, easy money. Slight miss. Uh, that, that inside post wasn't feeling that. I could tell my team was a little bit, uh, you know, annoyed there. Not annoyed, but, you know, we wanted to score. We, we were playing, um, we were playing for stakes, man. We were playing for a, a little bit of, um, a little bit of a gamble. Not really money, but more bragging rights. And these guys are hyper competitive, you know, so we want to win. Anyway, ball should come out to me here. I cut inside. Good movement from me. This is good movement. I take the ball. He's still running. Yatoro with a good pass out wide. Can we finish this? This should be a goal. It's not, but he does take out his own teammate, which is fun. There's a B-roll. Good touch from me. There's another pass. Key pass, Anton. Misses. Just like Anton, man. This guy can finish from any spot. And he reminds me a lot of Iron Robin. That's great touch there from teammate Yatoro with the ball. Yatoro cuts inside, just misses. But the, for the French shoot, Anton, he, he reminds me of Iron Robin. He's slow, kind of predictable, but somehow he converts goals just by, with a quick feint, a quick shoulder drop. And that's, that's something I love in his play style. I, I really, really admire that. That's a good turn from him. They should finish that. Trash finish. But the fundamentals there from the player um, in the all Nike. The dude's got a fit on him, I'm not going to lie. I kind of want to steal that fit though. His full compression gear outfit. It's winter though, it's cold there. Here in Vietnam, it's hot. You might notice, by the way, my background is different. And that is because I have moved um, to a new apartment. Um, so yeah, it's a lot more spacious. We're going to be filming a lot more videos here. I try to cut inside the ball. I actually got my head to that, guys. Like, I, honestly, I got my head to that. Uh, I, I think I was fearful. This is such an easy finish, bro. What a... I pass it. You know, my teammate there, I, he wasn't salty at me because I'm passing and giving him the goal opportunity. I think deep down, though, I was afraid I wouldn't finish in that position, and so I didn't shoot, to be honest with you guys. Like, if I'm just being honest, as a footballer, as a sportsman, I've never really lacked confidence, but in that moment i remember it so distinctively i can shoot maybe not get it or i can sweat it like you're in fifa and you want to pass you know like a square to go across goal and i did that and i should have just shot that ball man so i'm a little bit disappointed with myself there 
But I can tell as, we, as the game goes along, my confidence was creeping up. Good ball here to me. What can I do? Oh, that's an opening! That right there, that right there, that was my opening, man. You can see it, and that's what the GoPro gives me, is uh, when I look back, that was my opening. Tap to the right, shoot, and I would have scored that. Nevertheless, Anton with the ball. Anton to me, what do I have? Oh, two. Okay, I'll take it. You know, it wasn't, it wasn't that clean, but I'll take it. Key pass, bro. Key pass, and he puts it away. Bellatelli and my team, bro. I'm, he puts it away. I'm happy. Doesn't really matter, though, because they return literally from kickoff. But I'm happy with the key pass, though. I'm not going to lie. I'm very happy with that key pass. Here they go again. These two were a good link-up play. First time inside post finish. Lousy goalkeeping. Ass defending from me, to be fair. But does not matter. Decent ball. You can see here again, my team is good at really, really cycling the ball to one another. And so, so was their team. And I think that's fun to play with. Anton again, running, running, running. A slight takeover here. But again... The dude plays in slow motion, but he's hard to really know what he's going to do. Here I'm chasing them. I leave the ball here because I think my teammate is actually going to take it. And it catches him off guard, which unfortunately gives them a result in a turnover. But I did think my teammate was going to take it. Again, that's another opportunity to just put my foot down, hit over the ball and shoot. Here I'm in the right place. I try to actually flick him over. I just end up bodying Messi. I felt bad actually because you don't really see the impact, but I full force ran into that dude and just faded his ass. Right here, I get the ball. I'm a little bit off balance. I'm glad with the positioning here. This was a better positioning. Good ball to my teammate. I believe his name was Tom. Tom to Anton. Good little header back to the keeper. But this was when things started ramping up for me. I don't know why I was slow to start. Here again, I could have gone off my left foot. I don't. I go for the pass. Your Toro, what is it? Oh, oh, no, no. Oh, no, no. That was such a cool shot from Vittorio, man. I would have loved if that went in. I, you know those curve shots where they, they, their composure is on peak? I love seeing that shot, man. So when he hit that post, man, I was, I was in the game. Uh, you can hear my reaction. I'm, I was clearly very excited because I really wanted it to go in. I get hyped as hell for my teammates, man, because it's, it's genuinely like when you do something crazy in football, it's just so much harder than other sports that have played where you know what you're going to do. Anton, this dude, brother... Iron Robin, he's shooting on your left. Good intercept from me. What do I have? The space. Oh no, no! I gotta go. <laughs> and you can see there. I'm honestly, I'm over the moon with the fact that I scored a goal there because that for me, I needed that for my confidence, man. I'm telling you, when I put that ball away, I was very happy. Here, there was a good, good chance here, and I, I was apologetic because I could have got the ball fast to a teammate. I didn't quite do it though. We're playing with the ball here again. Ball goes wide. I'm telling him, please, just put it on my feet, not my head. It goes high. I would have headed it anyway, I'm telling you, man. The, the dents in my skull, I've got it right here, this crease mark. You can see this big-ass bit. That, that would have been a nice finish, but it was just too athletic for me. But anyway, you can see this crease in my head. GoPro dent, but I'm telling you, it's not because I frown so much. Good ball to me. Miss a key goal, bro. What the hell is that? That shit is ass. But that concludes our game. It was a good, fun match. And of course, I'm I'm happy I got to play in Tokyo. It was a good trip. I really needed it. If you guys want to see more of those the, the vlogging style of videos, please let me know, man. I always get so much footage when I go to these countries. Cinematic, gameplay, everything. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs>